All right. Welcome back to Board Reviews. Take care. Jody there. And we are excited for another episode clip reaction of Wilty. Or? Wilty. Would I lie to you? Today we're reacting to Does David Mitchell have all night parties at his flat? Nope. <laughs> There's no way he does. Okay. I don't think he does. Unless it's like chess parties or some nonsense. Not chess parties. I don't know. But there's no way. I'm already calling it. If you like our reaction, we're going to check this out right. We're not going to waste any time. She already had the headphones on. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you can be aware of our next uploaded video. Yeah, baby. All right. Do you think he has all night parties? Well, that's where like, I'm stuck. I would say no, too, because I was thinking about why you said no, because it doesn't fit like, it doesn't feel like it fits what we know of him. But at the same time, you have celebrities who have parties. The man doesn't even talk to the mailman for crying out loud. That Does that surprise you? Like, do we talk to the mailman? All the time. Here we go. Please welcome this week's special guest, mm -hmm. Sylvan. <laughs> So, uh, Ronnie Ancona, what is Sylvan to you? This is Sylvan, and he designed a household robot that speaks with my voice. <laughs> All right. Um, Chris. This is Sylvan, and he's my masseur, and he was also the guitarist in Simply Red. <laughs> right. All right. And finally, David. Uh, this is Sylvan, and he's my next-door neighbour, and I promised I'd get him on TV... <laughs> ..after... after he complained about an all-night party in my flat. <laughs> <laughs> so there we have it. <laughs> Lee, where would you like to start? Well, I sort of remember a bit about Simply Red. Uh-huh. Mm. Do you remember him in Simply Red? Uh, he was a lot more ginger. <laughs> <laughs> What, what was he the guitar player? Did you say? The guitarist, yeah. Lead guitar or bass guitar? I wasn't a big fan of Simply Red at the time. No offence to Sylvan. Just I'm just curious the... though, how you go from being a really good guitarist to, I'm sure, a really good masseuse. It, it is a good point, Gabby. Where you don't spend ten years of your life, you know, and it's high up because that's how they did yeah. it in Simply Red. Doing all that. Right? No, he did, he did play. that playing the bass. He, does he still just play. He got his fingers knowledge. against his muscles and, his, and he thought, I'm quite good at this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen any cyclists, I've got an idea. <laughs> David, on average, how often would you say you, David Mitchell, <laughs> throw all night parties? <laughs> Once every. It's like a ballpark figure. 14.7 years. <laughs> <laughs> so talk us through what happened. There's a knock on the door, I'm assuming. Knock on the door. I say it's and true. Uh, it's and I, I answer the door. And Sylvan said, oh, I'm, you know, can you please make a bit less noise? I'm trying to sleep. She says, and at which point I felt very guilty. I said, yes, we made a bit less noise. What, what were you celebrating? Your highest score at Scrabble? What was, what was it all about? <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, it was after an awards do. What and you just went, everyone back to, back to mine? Uh, not every... It was about sort of eight people. <laughs> so... <laughs> OK. <laughs> What about Ronnie? What do these robots look like and what will they do when eventually they are developed? To be honest, I actually haven't seen one. I was employed sort of as a voiceover artist. Um, do it. I, I, what, do the voice. Mm. Do the voice of the robot, yeah. Well, I recorded a whole lot of stock Great. phrases. Give us some, give us some stock phrases my one, my now. Okay. Um, my task is complete. Okay. Ooh. What do you want me to do now? Let's stay on that one. <laughs> <laughs> Any others? No, Shall Master. I... Sexual acts are forbidden. When you say, David, I feel yeah, like I've just been turned like down by C three PO. This is really, really plausible. It's certainly more plausible than David having an all night party. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, we've got to make a decision. Can we just have a quick look at Sylvan's hands? Those ah, are his hands. Ah, they are nice. Actually, that yeah. was a good clue, because Very if good. he hadn't have had any hands, that would have ruined... <laughs> 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 and the robot invention thing. But not David's, because, well, actually, he knocked on the door. <laughs> no, I don't know. <laughs> nice, strong... his head. No, Gabby, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Keep the noise down! I think Gabby's cracked it. A masseuse needs good, strong hands. Already. 
shit. This one is so funny. I wish it can go a little longer. And I love that Sylvan is like smiling along with it because I know they're supposed to be quiet and they always keep a straight face. Yeah, he's But it's kind of fun that it. he's just enjoying it. Yes. Okay. Um, the lady was so good at that yeah. robot voice. I'm just saying so good. However, I just want David's story to be true. I am saying David because I so badly want his story to be it's true. It's just because I said there's no way. That's the only reason why. Now, I just I'm to not going to lie. Like, when she had that voice, I was like, oh, okay, nice. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> she was, but she also did a She's really good, good like. She's so good at it. Mm -hmm. Like, Siri or whatever type of voice that was. Mm -hmm. That was really good. Um, Very calm and slow. Yes. I don't believe the masseuse and the guitar player one just because we didn't get any information on that. It could have been that. Yeah. But I don't know. Simply Red. Um, I love the ginger joke. That was pretty funny. But I am going to go. I, I'm going to go with the robot voice. Okay. Put your headphones back on now. <laughs> oh, seriously. Why did I take them off? I don't know. Jump in for the ride. <laughs> I have no idea. Bass player needs good, strong hands. I'm with Logan. I, th I think we're erring towards Chris, then, aren't we? You yeah. Strong what are you going to say? Oh. I'll go with Chris. OK, Sylvan, would you like to reveal your true Which identity? Uh, I am Chris Hoy's masseur. <laughs> and I'm used to being simply right there. Wow! Oh, my God. I have a little knot here. Could you just, <laughs> just come and have a little go? Well, now, put some effort into it, man. Don't just lean over. <laughs> Oh my God, David could have done that. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> so, uh, thank you very much indeed. Thanks, Congratulations. Sir. That was oh, awesome. That was good. That was good. Man, we were both wrong. Well, it, it, I, I don't know. Ruined my streak of two. Read at all, at all. But I felt like they had a really good point of like going from a guitarist to a masseuse is kind of an interesting. Like, yeah, I mean, you're you're in that band. Events. That's like that's like your lifelong dream, and then. Do I want to go back to four years of school, university, whatever you want to call it? Assuming I'm not assuming. Uh, so yeah, I mean, you do the trade school, less yeah. than two years, become a masseuse. Yeah. But it is kind of funny, like he's strumming it. Yeah, pretty good. <laughs> it feels kind of good. <laughs> Lee Mac is so funny. I I love. Told him. you there's no I way it was the part. I mean, even even he himself said 14.7. I had I eight people over. <laughs> But that's where, like, that's it's just hilarious. But I could see, though, like, the one time you have a party and your neighbors are like, listen, can't keep it down? You're like, I'm so sorry. Yes. I mean, we don't have a party ever, but I could also see, like, if we had a bunch of kids in our house, like, one of our kids had a party, yeah. it would get loud fast. Or in the backyard. That's, that's the yeah. thing, like, like I've you only, I never, I don't think I've ever asked anyone to quiet down. I don't know. Maybe I have. I'm not sure. I don't think so. But it's whenever in our old neighborhood people would hang out in their backyard oh, really, really loud and the walls were super thin. That was the most annoying thing because you don't want them to stop having fun. Or enjoy. And sometimes it was just like five adults around a fire pit like just, talking, just talking, but just, ah, ah, ah. Mm -hmm. They were laughing every few minutes. And when it's 11, 12 at night, 1 in the morning, I mean, it, your voice travels because it's so quiet. Uh, but yeah, no, but here, I mean, everybody's really respectful. We did have some, one, a neighbor throw a wedding reception in their backyard and they were really kind. They dropped off a little treat yeah, to each of the fans and said, Hey, you know, this is going to happen. Just so you're aware. If it gets to that, let us know. But when you let people know in advance, we're lenient. Like we understand what's going on and it's really, I thought I that was really thoughtful. I don't even think we even noticed it at all. I don't uh, make any noise. They did because I heard them with the music, uh -huh. but it wasn't like annoying. It was just, you know, dance music. I had my dance on last night at the eighth grade dance. I'm just saying, got my dance on. You were dance with eighth graders? Well, <laughs> at the dance, it wasn't like, let's slow dance. I was like, oh yeah, get on the floor. <laughs> she loves it. Anyway. She's, she, can, she can do that forever. She I did. I did. I got 15,000 steps in how, last night. I'm like, I'm like, what? How many seconds in the song until you did your famous little Actually, swim? Actually, I didn't do that one stop. time. No, I'm dead That's serious. That's your favorite go-to. I know. I didn't do it one time. I danced with a lot of um, our self-contained students. They were so sweet. They were like having their good time, and I just danced a lot with them, and... I was. I like your little wax on, wax off thing. Oh, they did play like, um, Outcast Hey Ya and then like shake it. So oh. we're shaking like a Polaroid picture. I don't know how you like just stopped yourself. Like <laughs> your mom just gave you a look like, 
Jody? I just, I just feel know like where you're like at. Nobody needs to see me shaking it. I'm sure, I'm sure they're enjoying it. If you like our reaction to this one, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time. Goodbye.